lead. We make winners who lead. Today, we'll see some questions based on May Mat question paper that was asked recently. Okay. Right? So, this is a question based on time and work. A can finish a work in 12 days. Okay. A can finish a work in 12 days. And B can do the same work in 18 days. B alone worked for 9 days. See here, B alone worked for how many days? 9 days. And left the job. Right? Now my question is, in how many days, A alone can finish the remaining work? How many alone can do your work in 12 days? B can do the same work in 18 days. What is the LCM for 18 and 12? Take LCM for 18 and 12. Consider it as a total work. 36 is the LCM, right? Okay, if I give 36 work to A, in one day he will complete 36 by 12 parts of the work. 3 work he will complete. And if I give 36 work to B, in one day he will complete 36 by 18, 2 parts of the work in one day. Now see, the question is, B alone worked for 9 days. So, one day, in one day, B can complete the work in, B can complete 2 work. And in 9 days, B can complete 18 work, right? In 9 days, B can complete how many work? 18 work. What is the remaining work? Okay, remaining work, 36 minus 18, 18 work. This 18 work is to be completed by A. Because B left the job. Okay, this 18 work is to be completed by A. So, 18 by 3, 6. So, 6 days is your answer. Very good. That is your answer. Okay, do you understand? Suppose in the same question model, they can also ask you. See, suppose I'll build some questions based on this model. So, it will be easy if you... Definitely, you can expect a question of this model, okay? See, if A can do your work in 12 days and B can do your work in 18 days. In how many days, they are asking, how many days? Both will complete the work. Both will complete the work. If they work together. In how many days, both will complete the work if they work together? That is my question. See, the A can do your work in 12 days and B can do your work in 18 days, right? What is the LCM for A, uh, 12 and 18? 36 is the LCM and I told you A can do 3 work in a day and B can do 2 work in a day. Okay, if both work together, 36 by 5, that is in one day both can complete 5 parts of the work. What is 36 by 5? 7, 1 by 5 days. Okay, they, see, there may be some options like 7, 2 by 5 days, 8, 2 by 5 days. So, you should be very careful while answering this question, right? 7, 1 by 5 days. Suppose, the same question, if the question is interchange like, B alone worked for, A alone worked for 9 days. The question is from B to A, if I interchange. A alone worked for 9 days and left the job in how many days? B alone can finish the work, if they ask you. See, I know that according to the question, in one day, a can complete 3 work. In 9 days, A can complete 3 nines are what? 27 work. What is the remaining work? 36 minus 27. What is 36 minus 27? 9 work. Am I right? And this 9 work is completed by B. Okay. So, the capacity of B for 1 day is 2 work. So, 9 by 2. 
four point five days. Four one by two days is your answer. Do you understand this? See, in this, they see the read the question carefully. In how many days A alone can finish the Dhavas remaining work? If the question is in how many days A alone can complete the total work? See. They ask you in how many days? Yeah, in how many days? See, sorry, not total work. In how many days the work is completed? The so simply they will ask you in how many days the work is completed. Okay, so for this you have to answer like first nine days B work nine plus and remaining uh, six days A work fifteen should be your answer. See, in your option you will also find six and fifteen. Okay, so read the question carefully whether they are asking remaining work or total work. Okay, the work is completed in fifteen days in total. If they ask you for the remaining work, you choose your option as six days. Do you understand this? Okay, these are the possible questions they can ask you. Learn to lead. We make winners who lead.